display order. I had a question earlier, and I said to hold off on that until now. But display orders. Um, I'm going to display some some text here. Um, we'll display a BGT and a BYZ and a BGM. Okay. And I have these in a cer certain orders, the English text at the top. Now, say uh, by default, uh, if you if you do that, you probably do not have your BGM at the bottom. And there's a reason for that, and we'll get into that in just a minute. But um, but the say I want to have the BG BGT at the very top. How would I do that? Well, we're going to um, set version display order, and this brings up your list. And at the very bottom here has the version list. By default, I believe it shows all versions, but we're going to show the active only. It makes it easy then to move things around. So I'm going to go down here to the BGT, and then I have buttons here to move up and move down. So I'm going to move to the top, and uh, let's move the NRS to the just below the BYZ. And click OK. And now you notice the BGT is at the very top, and the NRS is down below. By the way, you notice the blue color on the NRS? You know why that is? That's because that is the search version. That also is a toggle, or an option in the options window. If I go to Tools and Options, and I go to Flags, and Browse Window Configuration Options, and then uh, I go down to this button right here, Enable Browse Window Search Version Color. And if I uncheck that box, click OK, now the blue color is gone. That can be useful if you're doing a lot of, let's say, the text difference highlighting, or if you're doing morphological coloring, you don't want to have the blue color there, that's a good option to uncheck. Okay. So that's how you can how you can change your display favorites, display versions. Now you can also do um, some favorites here as well. I'm going to go back here to the button by the by the uh, command line and edit search and display favorites. Say you have favorite setups that you want. Okay, I'm going to add my current setup with the BGT at the top and the ESV, and I'm going to click add. I have a, now I have a set here. The RSV, or the, I'm sorry, the NRS is my search version. Notice then I have the WTT, the NRS, the BYZ, BGT, the BGM, and the ESV are all included. And uh, I'm going to edit that because I want to change the name. Now let's just I'm going to call it Disc 2, just for Display 2. Uh, short and no spaces. Click OK. And I have notice I have another one here that I created, a Greek one. I have a number of Greek texts here. Uh, BGM is a search version, I have BGT, BGM, and then I have a, a, quite a number of different Greek texts. Not all going to display at the same time because they're Apostolic Fathers, Josephus, Philo, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, but I can now uh, display these things, and so those are all saved, and I'm going to close that. So now I'm going to do the DGRK1 just to change, so that changed my, dis my display versions and then DDIS1, and now I'm back to my other display version. So this is a way that you can take a group of versions that you typically use and you can swap them with other ones. We did the ordering, now I have the ordering here. Now say I like these versions, but I want to change the order sometimes. Here I have a Greek text and I want to have an English text as my an order sometimes. I want to switch them back and forth sometimes. So I go up here to the, the button at the top of the browse window and I I choose here the set display, choose display, I'm sorry, set version display order. Now I have my order listed here. Notice here the save to file. Okay, so I'm going to save this and I'm going to just call this one test one. I guess you can call it anything you wish. It could be, well, let's call it the, let's call it the Greek and Greek one, okay, and save, okay, and uh, now I'm going to put the English, the ESV, I'm going to move it up, 
And now I'm going to save this to a file, and I'm going to call this English one. Click save. Okay. <clears throat> now right now I have the English at the top. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to type the letter O for order and space. And then this was Greek one. And now my order's changed. Notice the Greek is at the top now. And I'm going to type O space. And this was English one and hit enter. And now the English is at the top. So if you have, say you want to do the Hebrew studies, you want the Hebrew at the top, you might want to have a Hebrew where it sets up your, your ordering. So you can be switching just by simple command line switches, switching your ordering. Now if you want, you can go back to the button over where the command line says, you can go back here to uh, set your version display order and you can open a file and here's your English or your Greek or whatever and you can click open and uh, you click OK and your order then will follow whatever that is then. So. So, those are, so you have your, you can choose your display and you can choose your ordering favorites. You can have those presets that you want to switch with at different times. So, some configurations that you can do.